The following video contains content and or language which may be unsuitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. In our last episode of Looney Tunes Intro Bloopers, slipping back momentarily into an old habit, Microsoft Sam fired Radar Overseer Scotty yet again. Scotty threw yet another tantrum, then attempted to hang himself. Scotty was rushed to BFF City Hospital and Beulah followed, wanting to be with him in his darkest hour. Meanwhile, angered by Dave Madsen's banning the devil and she devil from appearing in his videos, the red knee yet, and rippy head and two headed pea head came to menace the studio staff. Microsoft had sent the red knee yet back, but the angry pea head and two headed pea head relieved themselves all over Harvey, Sydney, Learn Out and House be Michael, Learn Out and House be Michelle and Dave. An angel named Guy the White, the spirit of Guy the original shield guy who died in Looney Tunes intro blooper 70, War of Logos, cleaned up our heroes and sent the angry pea head and two headed pea head back, where they belong. With Scotty in the hospital, the rest of the staff carried on with the bloopers. Ready, Dave? Ready, Sam! Places everyone. Roll camera. Cue the shield. Where's the shield? Sorry, Sam. We forgot that Scotty's not here. Oddly enough, I kind of miss dressing Scotty down. You miss undressing him? He looked terrible in the nude. Uh -huh. Yeah. Warner Brothers? Not Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers. Whisper Brothers. They keep missing by a hair. Ha 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 ha. Warped Brothers. Good thing it wasn't Warped Brains. Not Warped. Warner. Take it easy, Sam. They'll get it right sooner or later. Remain. Come. Uh oh. Tantrum in five, four, three, two, one. No 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 damn 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 crappity 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 crap it's Warner not Warner Whisker or Water you hear me Warner 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 Warner
I sure miss them. Same old Sam. Once a DS artist, always a DS artist. Here is an urgent news bulletin. Security guard officer Flanagan has been kidnapped. Two shadowy figures somehow slipped past our security system and seized the security guard while the rest of us were sound asleep. This is Harvey Zilf reporting. What? Officer Flanagan kidnapped? That's right, Dave. I can't find him anywhere. Hi, Jane. What's the problem? Scotty, you're back. I missed you, Scotty. I missed you too, Eula. This is no time to get romantic. Officer Flanagan's been kidnapped. Holy shnikes. But our security system was the best in all of La La Land. How could anybody have disabled the system so quickly and so quietly? I don't know, but they left this note. What does it say? We have captured Officer Flanagan and disabled your security system. If you wish to see your security guard alive again, you must resent the ban on the devil and she devil from appearing in your videos. Failure to do so will not only result in Officer Flanagan's death, but also the destruction of Lo Al Lo Al Land. If those terrorists think they can get away with killing Officer Flanagan and destroying La La Land, they've got another thing coming. Agreed, Mr. Warner. If they even try to send the devil as she devil here, we'll have God and his angels on our side to beat those evil legions back. Well said, we're not an house be Michelle. This is Harvey Zilf with a very urgent news bulletin. The army of Rothluka has attacked the border of La Land. Troops have rushed to the scene to check the advance, but it is clear that the army of Rothluka is being aided by two demonic figures. We will have more on this story as it develops. Oh no! Not the devil and she devil again! Save us, Jesus! You always piss us off every time you say that name. It always makes our tails grow and... Ban violation! I call ban violation on the devil and she devil! Screw your bad violation. We got it rescinded the menu rough like that attack La La Land. Take it easy, Dave. You know these infernal imps can't win. Stay cool. Uh-oh. Tantrum is coming on! No, 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 damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! When I said the devil and she devil are banned from appearing in my videos, the ban is justified! Now get out of here before I call the almighty, you ass wipes, 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 ass Flattery, flattery, flattery. Ha 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 Your tantrums always flatter us, Dave. Keep it up. Not as long as I have a say in this. No way, Celestial Interfere. You haven't heard the whole story from us yet. We are waiting. Start lying. We sent those shadowy figures in to kidnap Officer Flanagan and hold him hostage. We demand Dave Madsen rescind the ban against us, or else. Or else what? If you don't rescind the ban, Officer Flanagan dies, no well land will become a permanent part of Rathlika, and all of you will be executed for treason. And not only that, we will ship all over you and your friends before your execution. Disgusting. You will never get away with it, because your laws are inferior to mine. Jurgen, you're already guilty of a man violation and are only making it worse for yourselves. Guy? Is it really you? Yes, Scotty, it's me. Guy the White. Those cities. We zapped my two smithereens and he comes back as an angel. No wonder we get more outrage every day. Rage all you want, but you'll never escape the truth. The laws of the Infernal are no match for the laws of the Supernal. So release Officer Flanagan and Zambus. Well, okay. We'll release him. But you must meet our other demand, rescind the ban against us. If you refuse, not only does Rothman take over, but you'll all face the death penalty. And we'll shit all over you. Disgusting and unacceptable. We say Jesus is Lord and that's that! This scandalous decision you made is the biggest mistake of your lives. Let's get them, she devil. Whatever you say, mom's away. Ha, huh, you missed again. They tried to relieve themselves on us, but the poop boomerang then hit them instead. Yuck, you tricked us again. Beaten again. 
serves them right for always trying to claim us as their own without conclusive proof. You said it, Dave. They are not only covered in their own filth, they are too weak to move. His mind powers always overcome the dark powers. You said it, bye. Now to send, send them back, back where they belong. Where belong. <laughs> You said it, Dave. Will you make sure they'll never use the rings as a portal again? Will you, Brother Scotty? It is as good as done. Later, after God, Angela the Angel and Guy the White sealed up the secret passage from the netherworld so that the devil and she devil can never again use the rings as a portal to the surface world. You need not see the devil and she devil barging into your studio again. The old passage from the netherworld has been sealed up, so they'll need to find another way in, which will be a long 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 time. Thank God! You're welcome. You're welcome. Here is yet another news bulletin. With a passage from the netherworld sealed up, Dave Madsen Enterprises Inc. is no longer in danger of invasions by the devil and she devil. Also, Officer Flanagan is alive and well and in good condition at the SF City Hospital. Finally, La La Land troops have beaten back the army of Rafuka. This is Harvey Zilf reporting. Uh, Scotty? Yeah, Sam? The shield is supposed to stop at full stature, not fly away. Look out! Runaway shield! Watch where that shield lands! Whoever catches it wins a brand new car. I thought it was a million bucks. Lol La La Land has a winnings cap. No wonder so few game shows are popular here. Tonight on a and &E. Secrets of the Runaway Shield. Scotty! Sam! Ah, it seems like old times again. I think Sam and Scotty are happiest when they're fighting. Not again, you sons of bitches! Are you hurt again, Scotty? That goddamn WB shield landed on my foot yet again! Well, I guess it's back to the hospital again. Poor Scotty can't seem to keep from getting hurt, can he? He can't help it if he's accident prone. He'll be in good hands at the hospital. Their top doctor is the best in all of La La Land. And who's that? Who else? Dr. Sheesh! Go syphilis. Boom! <laughs>